Hello, my name is Mitch, and welcome back to the Feed the Beast Voidbound server, where we're playing with the Dark Trilogy mod pack. And I'm just sitting here waiting for cows to spawn. And they just stopped. I think I may have broke it. Uh, I think it may be out, or... I don't know how these things work. Fish! Fish, come here. Tell me. How do you make this work? You're being very quiet today. And... Wait a minute. What in the blue monkey hell is this thing? A tiny potato? <laughs> it's got a smiley face on it. Oh, it loves me. I better... I'm, I don't want to touch that. That's disgusting. So, I'm hunting down for at least like one more piece of leather. That's all that I needed. And I'm afraid we're going to have to start searching the countryside for it. So I guess we'll just start wandering off in this general direction until we see a cow head pop up on our radar. It's going to be kind of dangerous going in the dark. I need a lantern. Is there any way to make a lantern in this mod pack? That would be very cool. Um, Cow? No cow? Oh, you've got a funny hat on. I'll take that. So anyway, how's everybody been doing? Yes, I play mod pack type things and then go look for basic things like cows. That's how the game works for me. No, I just haven't gotten fully established yet. We're still in the phase of playing with all the new things. Let's see, I still don't see any cows. Let's sleep. Whoa. I'm just waiting until we see cows come up on the radar. That's a bunch of creepers. Um, I can't climb this. Can we climb this? No. Let's just kind of tunnel our way up. We got an impromptu exploring episode. I can't see. Okay, we'll go this way. There we go. Well, no, there we go. Let's get up this mountain. Still don't notice any cows on the horizon. We got cocoa beans. And a floating beehive. I might have to come back for that. Wah! Jumping from tree to tree. Um, let's climb up this side. Tons of sheep. Still no cows. Good thing is, is it's starting to get bright outside again, so... Should be easier to navigate through this with it getting bright. Oh, I see you. Leave me alone. What is this? Where's that creeper? I don't want him to blow it up. Hello. That's weird. I'm... We're gonna move away from that. Don't know what it is, don't know what it does. But in case anybody knows, it's off in this general direction. So have fun with that. Okay, let's see. Still no cows. We got pigs. Is there any other way to get leather in a mod pack? I'm sure there is, but I don't know what it would be. Let's see. We're still not running into... I don't want to go too far. This is like a snowy area. Oh, I see cows over that way. Okay, good. What was that? Another... No, just a log. I thought it was another beehive. Oh, there's wolves over there, too. There we go. Alright, why don't you give me a piece of leather? By force. Alright, we got it. Now we can make our way back. Let's see, we can go back in this general direction. And we'll make it back to the house. Then we can do fun, cool, Minecrafty things. 
There's some berry bushes and things. Oh, there's an ice one. Wintry Hive. I'm gonna have to remember where that is. I like to play around with the bees eventually. Oh, and you've got a fun hat. Come here. Come here. Give me your hat. Just your hat. I wonder if we can put that on. Let's head H. There we go. Done. It's F5. Yeah, we look silly. Alright, that's enough of that. Seriousness, we gotta get back to the house. Which means we gotta go to our right. Okay. Let's keep going. We got a little bit of exploring done though today. That's not bad. I've learned a few things about this mod pack. One thing is you need a lot of iron. Seems like a lot of things you want to make use iron. Number two, you gotta do a lot of mining. I heard that. Where are you? Go away. Number three, it will take me a long time before I feel comfortable saying I have mastered everything in this. Because there's so many different things you can do. Okay, we got... Oh, we got cows right here. A ton of cows. I might try to grab some of them and lead them back over to the house sometime. I don't know, this is rather crazy terrain. I'm sure it wouldn't be easy. Okay, we're getting closer. I love the waypoint system thing. Wish they'd add something like that in vanilla Minecraft, because that is just really cool. Okay, yeah, still going that way. Got a cherry tree, or it looks like that. What kind is it? Sakura. Okay. Got something growing on that one. We got some berries. I haven't messed around with the berries much. I see a lot of people using them as like their main food source. Of course, I don't, still don't have a main food source either. I just pick things up off the ground and eat them. Cause I'm dirty like that. Oh, that sounded horrible. I don't really do that. Don't do that, kids. Don't just pick things up off the ground and eat them. Okay, that's cool colored leaves. Tiger leaves. Huh. Okay, let's... Wah! What kind of tree is that? Rubber wood. That looks different from the other rubber trees we found. Okay, we're just about there. There we go, we're home. Now the reason I wanted this leather... Well, actually first, let me show you. I made a little bit of a pathway here. Kind of playing around with different blocks. This is the limestone. I kind of like it. Played around with the chisel things and also did a little bit of organizing in here. Brought all the things up here. Made some cabinets. Which is really cool. That makes that noise. Put some of the bees up there. We got my friends right here. We got a furnace. An iron furnace. I can't really tell the difference between that and a regular furnace. Finish this little upstairs area a little bit. I'm gonna have to do a little more building out this away, because as you can see, I'm starting to run into the hill here. And a single log there. So now that I've given you the grand tour, let's get. Let's try. Hmm. Actually, first let's. Do I have iron on the bottom? Yep. Let's make an iron block. Because I don't think I have a, any iron bars on me. I'm going to wait for that to fill up. Okay. And harden. There we go. So give me that. I'll make nine little suckers out of that. Okay, now... I think if you go like this... And a stick. Yeah, let's go ahead and make two of them. Chisels. 
Now this game has several different kinds of chisels you can make. And all the other ones suck. Well, actually, let me show you real quick. I'll grab this one off the shelf. This one here, the iron chisel, you can't really do anything with it. Not that I've seen. If you eat on the ground, no, no. You can change these up. That's how I turn those into that. Actually, let me show you down here because it's stuff I don't care about. See if I go like this? I eat in its general direction, it changes block type. And that's about it. That's the magic of that one. The chisel, look at this. I can put any kind of block in here. Any kind of block. Well, maybe not. Let's go upstairs. Let's figure out how this thing works. So this one's horrible. I don't like it. Let's grab some cobblestone here. Okay. Do I have to do like this? No. Can I just right click it? Okay, I right clicked it. There. Aha! Now look at all these different patterns we could use. Dark panel with a dent. Cobblestone with huge cobblestone tiles. Let's do that. <clears throat> now let's knock some of our floor out in here. This is something we need to make pretty. Regular cobblestone is ugly. See, look at that. Ooh, ah. Let's do it again. Do this. Give me like this much. Any damaged cobblestone? Creeper cobblestone tiles? Aligned cobblestone bricks? Small cobblestone bricks? Let's see what that looks like. I think this is the chisel that everybody wanted me to play with in the comments. Ooh, yeah, I like that. But I think I like this one more. If we're going to do a floor pattern in here. Yeah. Yeah, I want to use that. Oh, well, I just... Let's go ahead and knock our floor out. While we're at it. We need to do lighting in here, too, eventually. Can I do that? Yeah. Give me this. I'll knock our door off. It's okay. Okay, we gotta pick up all this stuff that we can see, at least. And this one. And then get over this little area. I mean, we could even do different floor patterns for different little areas in the house, too. That could be cool. Let's lay this out and see what it looks like. Huge cobblestone tiles. Doot, doot, doot. Let's put our door back in place. We don't want nothing sneaking up behind us. Oh, fail. Give me that back. Okay. And then, crap, I'm going to need the hammer. Well, let's do that for right now. And then put our pressure plate back there. And then this. I'll just build everything in cobblestone from now on. I love this block. Look at that. It's so smooth. So nice. So pretty. Oh, I like it. I'm, I'm being very quiet because I'm just enjoying this block. I'm enjoying this block and everything it has to give us. I might put torches back down in a minute, though. Oh, come on. We're going to be one short. See, look at that. Floor looks much better now. So we're going to torch it up a little bit. Until we figure out some good lighting techniques. 
Now let's go with that. Can I, what if I do this and put this back in it? Can I change these into that? Yes, I can. Awesome. Now I wonder, can I do this with wood? What happens if I do it with these slabs here? Let's experiment. Chisel. That won't work. Okay, what if we did full blocks? Whoops. Let's... Oh! Large in this. And that. Hmm. Short planks. Fancy birch wood plank arrangement. What does that look like? Oh, goodness. I'm going to have... Like, what if we start getting rid of this now? Get rid of these slabs. And then put this down. Oh, it's even a little darker. Ooh, I could like that. I may like this. Now I just want to play with all of them. How does that look from below? I could like that. I mean, I kind of liked having the slabs there, but I don't have to. Ooh. Very nice. Okay, well now you definitely know what I'm going to be playing with. We can do all the things. Ooh, we could even do this in a different wood type too. And Oh, yep. Yep, this is... I'm definitely going to be playing around with this more. Let's get down here. Let's put that ladder back. And go to sleep. I need to make a bedroom, too. Let's get a quick drink. I still got my head down here. On D&H's sign. Um, so yeah, we're, we've got the basics, we're building the home. The next thing we're really going to have to do is pick a mod to kind of build our house around. Maybe expand off this way. I really want to play with bees. Bees, I think, are what I'm going to do. But there might be something else I need to do first. I'm not sure, because I haven't looked anything up yet. But yeah, this, this is going to be my friend. I like that. To everybody who suggested I should play around with that, you had very good ideas. Do I still have my hammer here somewhere? Um, no, I think I put it up here. Yeah. Give me hammer. Let's fix this door back. We had the screen door. Yeah. That one. Built a shelf here. We can put things on it. Put a bookcase over here. All in all, this is coming together fairly nice. I like it. I'm going to play around with doing some new decoration with these boring old block pattern types. And yeah. Yes, I'm very happy. It's a good day. Alright, what was I going to do with all that leather? I need sticks. Let's just use this. And then, nope. There we go. All right, let's make a bunch of sticks. And then I think it was like this. Nope, I need one there. Then that. Aha, there we go. Glider wing. Now let's make another one. Do, 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 do. Okay, we got another glider wing. Then I think you put them together like this. And then put a stick in the middle? Yeah. There we go. Hand glider. Let's play with this. Do I just right click it? Oh, I see. I've got it on me right now. So, can we go like that? Whee! Oh, that is cool! How do I take it off? Just right click it again? Yeah. Now it's in my hand. Let's try that again. Whoosh. 
That's too much fun. Yeah, let's climb on top of our house. <laughs> I just want to jump off things for the rest of today's episode. Oh, look at that. It's like makes you go faster too, even on the ground. Which is the hand glider, I know. It's supposed to do that. Ooh. Let's jump up here. Can I get up? Okay, that's getting a little annoying now. Let's see if we can get up to this highest point over here. Okay, this is pretty high. Now let's see how far we can get over that way. Let's put it on. Do a run. Whoops. That was anticlimactic. Run and jump. Now, can we really aim this at all? I guess you just kind of glide with it. Look at that. We can almost make it all the way to spawn. That's cool. Now, let's see if we can make it back. Making it back might be a little harder. Well, no. As long as we're on top of trees. We We're going to crash. No, no. What happens if we crash? Oh, nothing. We just gracefully fall. And I'm invisible. Oh, there I am. That is too cool. Look at me. Look, look. Wee! Floating hat. <laughs> okay, I think that's probably going to be it for today's episode. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure you leave a like, leave a comment, let me know what you think, and I will see you guys again next time.